Hey friends, this is Atif Opier Well and welcome to the new update on Algorand. As in my earlier video, I was showing you that on a daily time frame chart, after breaking out a descending triangle, Algorand was uh, testing the previous resistance of the triangle as a support. And in today's video, we will once again take a look at this move. You can see that it has re-entered the same triangle. But before starting this analysis, if you are not subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe it. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I'm sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. And if you would like to see how my trading signals work, then I've also shared the link for the previous, uh, not for the previous, for the current month trading signal report in the video's description for the month of August 2023. And this is the report. And for example, if you would like to check or verify any trading signal, like this is a trade setup for Cellocoin, you just need to click on the link and it will take you to the trading views chart. Like in this case, uh, this idea I shared on 4th of August of uh, Cellocoin. And this move was formed on the four hour time frame chart. And after playing this chart, you can see that how the price had moved up from the buying zone and rally to the sell target zone. After clicking this play button, it will show you that how the price had moved up from this buying zone. Now let me to take you to the live chart of Algorand. And this is the daily time frame chart. And previously we have been following this long down channel. And after the breakout, you can see the price line could not break out this downtrend line resistance of this descending triangle. We had rejection here. We had uh, two more touch points here, one more rejection here, and one more rejection here. And finally we broke it out here, but that was a fake out. And while retesting the previous triangle as a support, the price line uh, could not uh, save this level as a support and re-enter the same triangle. And now it is testing the support of the same triangle. Now we have one, two, and three more touch points almost here. Therefore, I'm going to adjust this uh, resistance of the triangle in this way. Now we have a rejection here. We have another rejection here, another rejection here, and this was another rejection uh, on 14th of August, 2023. And this is the support of this descending triangle. Now, if the price line breaks down this uh, descending triangle, uh, then the target for this breakdown uh, can be here. That will be approximately at uh, 7.3 cents. But in my point of view, after breaking down this triangle, it will be difficult for the price and very difficult to break down this long term support of 9.5 cents. And I will show you on the weekly time frame chart how strong this support is. By the way, if the price and breaks out the resistance after a successful retest of this support, uh, then after breaking out the resistance, the target to the upside can be here. That will be approximately at 16.4 cents. And the final target for this breakout from this down channel, and that move is, by the way, still due because we have already broken out that channel that can be here at the top of the channel, approximately at 23.5 cents. And if the price and reaches there, then here on the weekly time frame chart, it can easily break out this long downtrend line resistance of the falling wedge pattern now you can see it is quite squeezed therefore soon it can break this pattern and this is the 9.5 cent support level that i was showing you on the daily time frame chart and previously we can see when we had this big drop in the month of march 2020 but the price line could not break this level down and then we had a very massive pump and same as like that uh here in the month of uh, june 2023 we again tested this support could not break it down therefore I'm expecting that this time it will be again very difficult for the price line to break down this support level. And once the price line will be able to break out this falling wedge pattern, then the target for this breakout will be here at the top of the wedge that can be between $2.5 to $3. So this was the update so far. I hope that you've liked the analysis. Then do hit the like and do subscribe to the channel as well. And for more trading signals, you can also join me and support me as a YouTube member or as a Patreon member. Because here I am sharing different trading signals for you. And you can find a link to join me here in the video's description I've shared. Take care. Goodbye.